We begin today with the Golden State Warriors flipping the script on the Boston Celtics last night. The Warriors pounded the Celtics 35-14 in the third quarter and coasted home. That series is now tied 1-1. Wilbon, you were there. What did last night's win tell you about the Warriors? That Tony, they're still the Warriors in terms of name, brand, and brand recognition for most fans viewing this. But when you have Wiggins and Poole and you, you have new contributors, and they have to contribute, Tony, Looney, guys who were not contributors to the three championship teams. So you still have the stars. You, 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 you know, you have Curry, you have Thompson, and, and Clay hadn't played these first two games, really. And you have Draymond, who was at the center of last night's game in all ways. But the three of them by themselves don't get it. You didn't even have Andre Iguodala activated last night and in uniform, even though he was for game one. So these are like the core of the Warriors, those three future Hall of Famers. They're still there and recognizable. But if you don't get those big contributions from elsewhere, you get what you had in game one, where Boston gets an ensemble contribution and they get Al Horford to score big and they get this again. Last night, everybody chipped in. They defended the court and they pushed the Celtics down to a, another, a really poor shooting night. But that's the way they have to play, Tone, with that personnel. So you were not here Friday, and I will repeat what I said Friday to you now when you can hear it, that had any other team lost a game like that in game one, up 12 in the fourth quarter at home, and give up 40 points to a defensive-oriented team, and a team whose best player shot three for 17, any other team would have been reeling and panicked, but not the Warriors because of those three fellows and because of Steve Kerr. They are champions. They are veterans. They said, we're, we're going to be okay. And indeed, they were okay. You know, I mean, I don't want to get carried away here. So stop me if I'm going to get carried away. But there's no other team in the league that has earned the benefit of the doubt like the Warriors. And going forward, Mike, Boston has a very mediocre record at home in these playoffs. Yeah. They're only yeah. five and four. Yeah. So you could see Golden State winning at least one and maybe even two. Again, don't let me get carried away because Boston's very good and they're 6-0 and oh after losses in these playoffs. But it felt like the Warriors were saying, okay, we get it. Here we are. Tony, I, do th I agree with you to this extent. They had to make the adjustments. And usually the Warriors are not on their heels being the counterpuncher. But they were yesterday. But they did fine at it. I'm glad you mentioned Steve Kerr real quickly. Tony, they had to, 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 to have some defensive adjustments particularly so that they weren't just facing a, a lights-out Boston Celtics team offensively. They made those adjustments. Now it's Boston's turn to adjust. That's the great thing about a series. And people will wind up declaring crazy things. It's a back-and-forth situation we're in now. I, I love where we are in this series to watch it. The Tampa Bay Lightning. Give me one Lightning second. Give me one, hold it. Give me one second. Give me one second okay. to talk about the Draymond Green foul. He could have been tossed. Could easily have been a yeah. technical. Would have been his second. I thought so he would have been first, out. but the replay, I, think, I was like, nah. Well, here's what I think. I think his reputation has gotten him unnecessary fouls in the past. So as far as I'm concerned, right. it's evened out. But the important okay. thing to remember is this. Draymond Green does not modify his style of play. If you think he's going to try to avoid these no, situations, not. you're insane. He's, he's going That's right, right back That's right. at it. That's right. We've had some years of this now to get used to that tone. You were right about that. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.